So uh, it's it's sort of like CNN if if the C actually stood for cannabis. A Scottsdale-based company here is offering six straight hours of live coverage tomorrow entirely on the politics of marijuana. 3TV's Derek Stahl joins us live. And Derek, this is billed as the first election night coverage of its kind. Yeah, it sure is. And this right here is the virtual set for what they're calling Marijuana Election Night 2016 on CannabisRadio.com. They're going all out with live video, interviews, and results entirely on cannabis. It's all because they say tomorrow's election could be a turning point in the marijuana debate nationwide. It's got the glitz and graphics of a network broadcast. And for the team at CannabisRadio.com, that's exactly the point. Of Marijuana Election Night 2016. When the marijuana issue comes up, it always gets a chuckle. It always gets a pop pun. It always gets some sort of denigration or demeaning uh, of the serious nature of this issue. And that's what we're looking to add to this coverage is treating it as we would treat any other serious social justice issue. Russ Belleville is used to doing marijuana advocacy on internet radio. Time for our Hemp Day Hump Day update. But come Tuesday, he'll co-host six hours of on-camera coverage, live from a studio in Los Angeles, alongside a crew of about two dozen people. It's the biggest production I've ever been a part of. Belleville says they'll have live reports from the ground in all five states where marijuana legalization is on the ballot. Their goal? Clear up questions that have been lingering throughout the campaign. Is marijuana more potent? Is it more dangerous? Are things going uh, well in Colorado or are they not? We want to present this issue fair, balanced, factual. Belleville predicts by the time their broadcast ends, California, Florida, and Maine will all vote to legalize recreational marijuana. He says Nevada and Arizona are still up in the air. And Belleville points out if California legalizes, it'll make recreational marijuana legal throughout the entire Pacific time zone. And he argues that will be the final straw for federal prohibition. Now, their live broadcast starts at 4 p.m. Arizona time tomorrow. We've got a link to that on our 3TV mobile app. Back to you. Interesting stuff. Mm -hmm. Derek, thank you very much. In the meantime, opponents of recreational marijuana in